I think there's, from what I've heard from people that know a lot more about viruses than I do, that 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 unfortunately this will make it through the summer, and and in terms of having a vaccine, it's you know a long ways off. So uh, you've got, uh, you know, it is scary stuff. Uh, I don't think it should affect what you do in stocks, but uh, but it, in, in terms of in terms of the human race, it's scary stuff when you have a pandemic. Yeah, I, I guess this one's particularly frightening because it's new. Uh, so there's no natural immunity that's built up in any of the populations, and you wonder what happens, particularly in areas where there's not the same healthcare structure that we have in America or in some of the developed nations. I, I guess that's a big part of the question too. Yeah, um, and it's it's. Uh, well, I think about it in terms of our annual meeting. I mean, it, which is May May second. I mean, it it uh, it could very well affect by that time. It could affect. Uh, we, we've got questions from viewers asking just that: Will the annual meeting be any different this year? Particularly because you have a large uh, Chinese contingency of shareholders who yeah, come I don't here think, for that. Yeah, and that certainly will be affected. And and uh, and incidentally, I mean, flu is particularly tough on old people. <laughs> yeah, if you're going to have two guys on the stage who's Combined age is 185, so <laughs> well, we'll, we'll, uh, we, we won't be looking for people that are showing any signs of contagion. <laughs> but that's one of the problems with this is that it does have a long gestation period, that, that, right. uh, and, and it's highly transmissible. 